You're about to meet a local kid, a 12 year old that takes his sport so seriously. He'd rather work hard than play hard. 23 ABC's Stephen Hicks explains for us tonight. Yeah, Jackie, while most of us celebrated 4th of July with fireworks and barbecues, Peter Choate spent his day like any other working out, eating right and training to be one of the top riders in the racing world. Riders ready, watch the gate. As the saying goes, good things take time. Bakersfield's Peter Choate hasn't had a lot of it, but he already seems to get that. I don't really think, I just do. Watch Choate on the BMX track and you'll see he's just different. It must be his vision or something because he just knows the right line to take. That vision helping him to stay in every race. When you're racing, you don't really think of anything. You just, it just happens naturally. Call him a natural then. On tracks from Vegas to Chicago, Atlanta to Tulsa, Choate has won more than 100 races nationwide. He won the first time we went to the track. Like any parent, so much time away from home can take its toll. It's very hard, but um, we've been kind of grooming him for this for a long time. Remember, good things take time. Choate has been putting it in for years now, even though he's just 12 years old. Yeah. Living in Bakersfield, commutes to world-class tracks in LA and Lemoore are long, but it's his intense workouts that set him apart. I'm just showing him the path of, of how to get there, and he's he's excited about doing it. He runs football stadium stairs, does plyometrics. Drink protein all the time after I work out, basically every day. How many 12-year-olds do you think do that? Not that many. No. <laughs> Not in racing. That work ethic paired with his natural ability to be in the right place has him dreaming for the future. I want to win a gold medal for my country. When BMX became an Olympic sport in 2008, Choate's lofty goal suddenly found clarity. Already more than 3,000 people are watching him chase his dream on Instagram. The way he treats people, he's, he treats adults and younger kids with respect, and that's why his fan base, I think, is so big and why he's so popular. Good things take time. Peter Choate hasn't had a lot of it through 12 years, but he's making the most of his time and looks to be on the right track to seize his moment when it comes. Now, he was in Columbia last year for the World Championships. This year, that'll be in the States, and ranked fourth in the nation, Choke will look to take the crown later this month in North Carolina. In the studio, Stephen Hicks, 23 ABC Sports.